So welcome, welcome to these highlights from the um, live streaming that I did a uh, couple weeks ago. Yeah, about the the contest of spawn, um, which is a spawnery contest. So it's basically a contest wh where you draw spawn in January. That's why spawn spawnery, I guess. That's what Todd McFarlane has come up with. <laughs> Uh, so what he did, uh, what what he wants to do is basically find a, a cool cover for um, to put as a variant cover on a number of spawn. I don't know which one, which we'll see in in, in the future. By the way, so like hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of artists will be participating to this. So I I did my part in it as a challenge. Um, as a challenge for myself, I mean, I mean, I like challenges. I'm always, I want to take on challenges because, I mean, not any challenges. I'm not the kind of guy that like will uh, uh, go up against everything just because uh, I like to fight or or challenge anything. But it's just in my field. I like the challenge because it's a way to it's a way to improve I think and I like that so in this case uh, I wanted just to test my abilities in drawing first and then my abilities to understand a character there that I, I don't know anything about <laughs> basically <laughs> because yeah that's it I don't know I literally know nothing about spawn and never read a spawn you may say oh out there Say you are a comic artist and never read a spawn, I don't give a shit. You know, it was never a character that um, uh, caught my eye in, in any way. But yeah, th th this was the time that I thought I could actually pick up a copy of spawn and, and, and read it. I didn't do it yet, but I guess I'll do it um, soon. So, uh, talking about the, the the drawing itself, it was it was a good challenge because I what I did is just went on uh, Google and searched for spawn and yeah, basically look at the suit for, first of all, what it's made of, what are the focal points of it, what what is wearing, what is the uh, distinctive thing. It makes it what it is. So first, uh, first thing I noticed was the of uh, the, the pointed uh, things uh, on like everywhere. Uh, I don't know. I should say in, in English, le, le, le borche. <laughs> so yeah, and then the the chain. Obviously, the chain is a big part of it, uh, and the skull. There are many skulls on it. Uh, yeah. So then, then I studied it a bit. Like looking at hundreds of hundreds of of images, so what I did is just I thought of the coolest pose that I could think of, and I drew it and and just and I dress it up with the suit. So yeah, I I think I did a, a, an acceptable work, uh, an acceptable job, like a decent job for my abilities. Uh, by the way, I did only this one and, and the Gunslinger one because, as you know, the challenge is made of uh, four covers that you you can do in, in four weeks, one per week. Uh, so the first one is about spawn itself, then, then there's Gunslinger, and then Scorched, and, and then any other villain. I guess yeah uh, so I did only spawn and gunslinger spawn alone which is the one you're, you're seeing in this video and but then I stopped because of two reasons basically one just just because uh, the overload of work that I had to do uh, well, with, with the school of comics and, and stuff uh, which, which which was really overwhelming and the second reason which is more psychological just because I've seen uh, all these other artists participating to the, the to, to the contest and 
and and they are amazing and they are like so good so good uh so much better than me and and and, and so i thought I, i'm not really going to win honestly you know <laughs> <laughs> let's be honest I'm not going to win this and so I thought what was the point in making the, the other illustrations so that's what I thought I'm, I'm I'm not likely to think like this always I mean in general it's not the way I think but yes I'm just telling you what what happened so uh, yeah that's it I mean again I think I, I did pretty good job with this one it's pretty simple it's, it's I mean it's cover and it must be uh, simple in in a way so um, but yeah uh, that was my challenge about doing uh, about drawing a character which I don't know anything about and I think it's good doing this kind of thing just because you challenge yourself with uh, with the unknown, which is what we need to grow. Which, because if you always stay in your comfort zone, you're not going to uh, grow in any in any case, in any field of... Well, well, uh, in anything you care about, basically. Um, so, yeah that's that's all for this video and uh, if you want to join me for any other live streaming I'll do basically you you can subscribe to the channel and um, you can check all the other link for social media or all my socials and we, which are in the video description and yeah thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one